Hi friends, Misha Crossing here. I forgot I did the diving trick last night. Oh goodness, and I've just got mushrooms and coins everywhere. Uh, I did not get anything suggested. I only did it probably like, I probably did it for an hour. I probably went up to land about four or five times uh, trying to get something suggested to me, but to no avail, yet avail, yet again. Oh well. Um, put a mushroom down here. I'll kind of walk around down putting mushrooms down. Uh, I don't really know what I'm going to do today. Oh, I thought about um, going to the island, so I might do that. Do some tours there, see what's for sale. Um, which mushroom? This one. Sure, why not? Um, mushroom here. Yes, yes. And... I don't know what's gonna go up here yet. But I'm gonna put a mushroom down. Oh, and San's house definitely needs more mushrooms around it. I'm gonna put one... I'll do this one up here. Move these roses. Um, yeah, one right here. Hmm. I keep going back and forth. I guess one right here. This one. And maybe one back here. Yes. Yeah, it's looking okay. It's gonna look better when I have more, more flowers, I think. Put one back here too, last one. Yay. All right, I need to put the, I'll put the roses right here. This is a good place for them. All right, oh, where did I put all of my tools? What did I do with my tools? Oh, I put them in my storage. I forgot. Because <laughs> I went to go pick up these mushrooms from someone. Have I mentioned the person I got mushrooms from? Did I? Yeah, I did that last episode, right? Okay, if I didn't mention the person I got mushrooms from, thank you so much, and I'll link you in the description box. I just can't, can't remember. I feel like I did, though. I got that fireplace and I got some mushrooms from, from people, so <laughs> I want to make sure I thank everybody. People are so nice. Glad people are just giving me things. I think I did, what did I do? Oh, I'm giving someone a large bookshelf in return. I'm going to get some more mushrooms. Yeah, and I'm going to give someone a large bookshelf. Um, I need to go into my storage. Did I put my... I don't remember where I put my tools. If they're in here or my regular storage, I know not. I think they're in my regular storage. Yeah, okay. Let me just run up here real quick. Get them. Can't take on a day in the town without my tools. Get into my little, uh, just standard closet. Nothing to see here. Well, shoot! Where are my tools? Oh, maybe I set them down by the train station? That's gotta be what I did with them. Okay. To the train station. <laughs> still need to redecorate. I am getting uh, some new furniture items and I'm getting Eric from someone in the next couple of days. Once Peck moves out tomorrow, I'll be picking Eric up, uh, which is really exciting. I will uh, then plot reset for him. Oh, hi, Bob. And have a cute new deer villager. So we meet again, Misha. Again? Have I already played today? Uh, hold on. Okay, what's the latest? You're the most fired up person in town. I asked Jingle for some clothes this year, so Bob wants orange clothes. What is today? Did I not change the, the, day, the day? It's Wednesday. Hold on, everybody. Hold on. Okay, I'm good. I haven't filmed an episode <laughs> on Wednesday. That was just weird that he said hello, you know, again. 
Huh. Maybe I accidentally moved the day forward whenever I did the, the diving trick. Hmm. It's possible. Oh, here are my tools. What's this? Probably something I need to sell. Oh no, the trash can! I need to put that in my house. Somewhere. I need to sell the... Uh, uh, uh... Amethyst? I think is what that is? Oh yeah, that's just... There wasn't anything new, but... <laughs> fishing tourney. This Saturday. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and go up to Main Street since we're up here. Now that I finally tracked down where I put my tools. Um... Okay, I don't need to go over there. <laughs> Sorry, I was still thinking again about whether or not I mentioned the person who gave me the mushrooms. And I don't think I did since my tools were sitting out. That means I just got the mushrooms um, after the last episode. I can't remember. Oh, yeah. Okay, I remember. So, I started to film um, today's episode, uh, Wednesday's episode last night. But, like, two minutes after I started filming, my boyfriend got home. Um, so I was like, eh, I want to spend time with him and make dinner. So I just stopped recording and uh, did it today instead. Um, and I had started to mention the person that gave me mushrooms last night. But, you know, I didn't finish recording that so it didn't get into a video so yeah thank you so much person who gave me mushrooms i'll link you in the description box <sighs> wow that was a whole mental journey oh a little tabletop game there's a uh a bar downtown that's close to us that has um like tabletop arcade games and like big, you know, actual arcade games like pinball machines and and whatnot, um, Street Fighter, all that. And they actually just got a PS4 virtual reality, which is really cool. I tried that out a few nights ago. It was the first night they had it, and yeah, Monday night. It was the first night they had it, and uh, so it was free because since it was their first night, just trying to get everything set up and make sure everything was working okay. But it was just like a 10 minute thing. It was, I mean, you, you were like this guy in a cage underwater. You know how they put people in cages and like lower them into the sea. Um, so you're one of these guys on some sort of uh, salvaging expedition and all you could do was just look around. You couldn't interact with the world at all. You were purely watching, but it was really, really cool um, seeing all the fishies swimming around and, uh, you know, hearing what was going on around you, what you were looking for, and then finding this sunken ship, and eventually this shark comes and attacks you, um, which is, I mean, it was kind of scary, but the graphics weren't so real that it was... Um, like terrifying and it didn't jump out at you in any heart attack inducing way but it was it was really fun it was just a 10 minute uh, exposure to virtual reality and I thought it was really fun I just can't wait to play a virtual reality game um, you know like an actual game where you can interact with the world and move around and in instead of just you know sitting there and only being able to observe. Oh, I need to look at my initiatives. Local fruit initiative. Oh, hi, Marco. Marco's coming up on the desk with me. What really keeps the doctor away? Selling five of any fruit ripened on the trees of Kodama. Okay, I can do that. Uh, beekeeper initiative. It's time to take action against bee stings and all that they stand for. Now go catch a bee and give it a stern talking to. Oh gosh, I don't like that, uh, that initiative. But I'm gonna try... Okay, let me have... Oh, you can't have your net out and shake a tree, can you? Yeah, you can. Cool. That makes it easier to catch bees. 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 Nope, no bees. <clears throat> Margo. What do you want, honey? She's standing right beside the microphone, just looking at me. Ooh, money! Aww. This tree died. Why? Is it too close? It's not too close. Oh, maybe it is too close. Maybe it has to be two spaces in front of a house. Margo, honey, 
Now she's stepping on the keyboard. Just get into my lap. Is that what you want? That's all she wanted. She just wanted to be in my lap. There you go. I'll pet her a little bit. <sighs> oh, I do need to plant the things I just bought. Oh, dear. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> that was not fast enough. <laughs> they got me. Uh, I've never caught a bee before like that. <laughs> ow, 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 I got stung by bees. Oh gosh, look at me. Now I have to walk around the rest of the episode like this. I'll get medicine tomorrow. <laughs> oh, hi. Little Clay. Whoa, look at your face. Did you get stung by a bee? I've been stung before too, so I know how rough it can be. But it'll get better if you just wait, so don't get too down, Misha. Aw, thanks. Or wait, once you save and quit, it'll be gone. Uh, the next time you load up, I think. Oh, wow, there are two dig spots back here. Fossil. Okay, is the other one a fossil or a gyroid that I missed the other day, maybe? Oh, yay, fossil. Cool. Alright, oh, I want to plant the things I bought. Yeah, Margo is sitting so contently <laughs> in my lap right now. It's exactly where she wants to be. Um, okay, yeah, right here is where I will put... Eh, no, I don't want to put a tree right there. I'll put a tree right... here? Hmm. Sure, right here. Why not? Plant. Give myself that money. Put that down there. Okay, bushes. I'm gonna put a bush right here. Looks good. Okay, we got a sweet olive and a white azalea. <laughs> Not a lot of uh, variety from the area that's already here, but oh well. I really don't want to do too much more around Flo's house, because she is going to move out at some point. Um, yeah, I just don't want it to be... I have to redo everything if like another villager moves nearby, or if I put a public works project there. Um, I'm debating where to put the bushes. Uh... Or the bush, I guess the one other bush that I have. There we go. I don't know if Margo is like confused by the cords, but she seems kind of uncomfortably still right now. Honey, what are you doing? There are just a couple cords laying on top of her, but no, no, okay, I just pet her. She's happy. She's purring. <laughs> okay, oh, I need to go sell um, five fruit. Um, okay, let me grab one, put that there, put these guys back up here. Okay, let me clean out my envelopes, maybe. <laughs> Just a teensy bit. No, wetsuit stays in there. Glow wand I'm gonna keep too. Oh, are these all? I think these are all fossils. Yeah, I need to just put those in my... Mm-hmm. Put those in my storage. And the glow wand I'm gonna keep too. Okay, so I ended up taking nothing out of my pocket. So I don't want to sell the trash can. Although I don't know why it is up there. Okay, let's go into retail. Maybe I'll buy out retail while we're here. Oh, what's on premium? CDs. Okay, probably not gonna do any of those. Um, oh, I need to plant a tree right here. I'm gonna plant a perfect apple tree right here, actually. Well, I guess I need to get a perfect apple first. Very one, yay. Put that back up there. Yeah, that spot really, really needs a tree. You know, when you, you just see a spot and you know it needs a tree. That's how I felt. Hi, Reese. I would like to sell you some fruit for an initiative. And this amethyst, just while I'm here. Oh, I need to do the diving trick soon. I mean, not the diving trick. God, the, just go to the island soon. Um, I don't feel like buying not retail right now. What am I saying? Uh, yeah, go to the island soon and catch some bugs. I think I'll do that um, when I take a little break from, from filming and, and writing later. 
Uh, cause I need to make some bells so that I can expand my house. I'm gonna be getting some new furniture items from the guy that I am picking up, Eric from Marco. Why do you have to be so difficult? She wants to be in the most complicated spot. Let me. Oh no, noises. Noises are happening. Okay, she. Okay, I've successfully lifted her without messing up any cords and put her on the floor. Yeah, so I'm getting some new furniture items from the guy that I'm getting Eric from uh, tomorrow, which they're gonna be mostly items from the Welcome Amiibo update, um, ones that I likely won't be able to get for a long time with uh, various cards and Amiibo figures. So uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and get them from a person. And I think a couple other items I've had a hard time getting, um, but not every, I, ha I do have a wish list, so I'm not, you know, getting every single thing on my wish list. Just a pretty big handful of things that I know I won't be able to get for a while. Uh, oh, I need to go to the campground and see who's there. I think that will be the last thing I do this episode. <clears throat> I don't know why I took that really roundabout way. Oh, hi, Peck. You're leaving tomorrow. I wonder if I'm tired. I feel like I'm seeing some weird creature right now. But on second thought, you kind of look like Misha? Wait, now I get it. You got stung by bees, didn't you? If those buggers can chase you down, maybe you're not training hard enough, Misha. Oh my gosh, Margaret's almost knocked over her water bowl. She likes it. You know how cats do the thing where they check if there's water in the water bowl by pawing at it? Sometimes she just paws at it so hard and it just rattles it. Oh look, there's red. So that'll be the last thing I do in the episode is go see Red. <laughs> uh, what's Harvey got? He's got a, a run-down gas station, kitchen sink here, and uh, some propane tanks. <laughs> oh, and then this is... I can never remember who this is. Is it Blanca? Yeah, it is. Hi, or Blanca. I don't know how to pronounce her name. Blanca because her face is blank. I guess. I don't know. All right, not a lot going on up here. Hi, birdies. Hello, giant trees and holly bushes. My god, they're massive. Bye, Harvey. Enjoy your book. Oh, I need to bring up Red's um, art guide on my phone here. Let's see. Uh, ACNL. Nope. Cancel. ACNL. Red. Art. Okay. Oh my goodness, what is in here? Is that a panther? It is a bear? A fox? Something. Can't really tell what it is. Oh, uh, that one, I think that one's fake because it has a big hole in the leaf. That one I'm not sure how to tell if it's fake. And that one I'm not sure how to tell if it's fake. Okay, so let's take a look here. Yeah, what is this creature? I think it's a fox or maybe a wolf. Ooh, maybe it's a wolf. <laughs> I just don't know. Okay. Scrolling, scrolling. Oh, this one. They're common painting. Oh, this painting is always genuine. So this one right here is the genuine one. Cool. But I do want to look and see what this fox sculpture is. And how it's real or fake. Ah. It's uh, called the Motherly Statue. And the actual name of the sculpture is Captoline Wolf. I don't know what the first word means. If there is only one child... Whoopsie daisy. Only one child below the wolf, it's fake. If there are two children, then it's genuine. Okay, there's only one child, so it's... I mean, I already knew it's fake because this other painting's genuine. But good to know. Two children. Genuine. So let's get this common painting here. I'll take it. Give it to Blathers. I'll mark this common painting as a sold item. Everyone else is out of luck. Don't you worry, I'll wrap this up nice and safe and mail it to you as soon as this exhibit is over. But remember, if your mailbox is full, it won't get delivered, so make sure you've got the space ready. I've got the space in my mailbox, don't worry. All right, well, I think that is it for this episode. I'm excited to get my painting tomorrow. Um, I'm not sure what else I'll do tomorrow. Maybe I'll, uh, 
Hmm. Have some money to expand my house? No, I won't have that tomorrow. Maybe I'll go to the island and do some, uh, do some tours tomorrow. We'll see. We'll just see what happens. Hopefully I'll be a lot prettier than I am right now with my eye patch and other swollen eye. Alright, thank you all so much for watching. If you want to follow my other social media, links are in the description box. You'll have a wonderful day, be kind to one another, and don't forget to be awesome. Bye!